Hey there Taurus, welcome to this Twin Flame Tower Love Reading. My name's Sophia, welcome back or welcome if you're new. I'm going to jump straight in. Um, if this doesn't resonate, it just doesn't resonate, just let it go and um, check out your other star signs. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm going to take them. All right, what's going on? Why did they all fall to come out? Why, one sec. There. So you can see them. Tower. Who's had a tower moment? Let me see what's going on. Contradiction, eh? Ah, okay. What I'm getting from this first line with the tower here, someone's understanding, so this is good so far, that their third eye with the eye here, that um, their foundation has to crumble, which is third dimension, people chatting bollocks in their ear. Let's just be honest with this. Look, passionately telling you what to do, right? Someone's recognised this for whatever reason. And the next card is the... Um, Queen of Swords, which states that they're going to um, now follow the twin flame journey correctly by relieve it, re releasing the mask. Look, her hand is not, you know, it, the arm is stating it. She's not or him, but, you know, in their truth. But can you see it's kind of they're lifting it? It's not just down, is it? It's just kind of like lifting up towards her truth to go towards her wish come true with the star in the background with um, following the guided um, angels and um, understanding she is a star seed and also or him or she's a star seed and like I said from 5d 4d upwards from higher mind so this is someone like I said previously went down the third dimensional route but now is understanding that's wrong I'm following old belief systems, people's opinions, what's not, and moving forward because I am a queen up in here, but I'm not attracting what I really want. That's what's going on here. I'm in this corporate job. I've got my money up. I'm doing whatever. But look, I'm still, this person still searches. This queen of, queen of discs is still searches. This is someone, like I repeat, follow the third dimensional perception or be independent, be the empress. And they thought, well, that means about getting in the job, slogging away, getting my money up. But look, still attracting nothing. Desert. Because she went down the wrong path. And with this is the, the, the devil horns that looks like is was manipulated incorrectly, which controlled their thoughts or her thoughts because it's on the brain here. How to get the money. And look, you thought it was correct because you're grabbing hold of that, but still searching for your person. Where's where, where's my person? I'm looking glamorous. Where's my person? So someone's that's crumbled underneath the the tower. The foundations crumbled. Is this one? This means pointless because understanding that this was pointless because I wasn't in my truth. This is a mirror a facade. A, a, the mirror is smashed, meaning that two aspects of, you know, breaking that old pattern because it's underneath the tower. Also, understanding what it's third dimensional, which is blue. It's cold. It's also a reflection of your person. Your person is the third dimension, not you. So you're understanding the dynamics. You also understand with these three swords here that because you wasn't in your truth, it's created heartbreak, which reflects on your person. Or your person's creating heartbreak, which reflects on you. Because, once again, the moon, 
there's more that you didn't know, you didn't understand, and there's more to know. I'm just going to see what this means as well. Aquarius, which is... Eleventh house, friends, family. You was influenced by friends and family. This why heartbreak, which I said, who who's passionate in your ear? This person who's had this understanding, who this resonates is is once they well they're moving towards it because underneath now when you're in four D five D, we're moving them out. The mask going towards your wish come true, going to understanding your star seed, you're from 4, 5D and trying to be in your truth pushes the will of fortune forward. This is purple, this is spirituality, this is, can you see the, the lightning here of the strikes of the, the, the tower had to happen before you can move into your fortune. And this is fortune of abundance of all aspects, which I've done a video about, please see today, about getting your pentacles up. Underneath the queen of discs, which is might as well be the empress, is this one. That's why it felled. Not only did it fell, what felled? These are feathers. What do I say? Feathers, wings, birds, butterflies. What felled? Your twin flame felled. Seven of Discs is working at something like you worked at a foundation from third dimension tarot, said work, be at the Empress, get your monies up, be independent. It failed and you got stuck at the Seven of Pentacles is when they're standing there looking, searching what to do next. This person is searching what to do next is underneath that card. The, the root of this is that you had to emotionally walk away from your past upbringing from people in your ear from the tower of people saying this you had to emotionally move away from that because it's affecting you it's affecting how you perceive this reality this is um i can't pronounce that which means lazy how many times do i say up in the air you're emotionally lazy. How many times do I say it? <laughs> yeah, it also means avoidance. You avo you was avoiding the truth of how to be abundant in your uh, fortune and cre create your own abundance. That's how you get your Ten of Cups. How? This is internal blood vessels inside manifests outside is a by energetic form from inside to outside is how you get your ten of cups not by making it in the third dimension getting my money up looking glamorous no this is how you do it so this is a great reading so hopefully it's resonated for you and thanks for listening